The science has made it absolutely clear that forests are essential to tackling the climate crisis. For example, halting deforestation can cut greenhouse gas emissions by 11% annually. Restoring landscapes, including through reforestation, is also needed to maintain and enhance carbon sinks. We know that forests do more for the climate than just store and sequester carbon. A lot of the science recently has shown that forests provide dramatic global cooling effects through evapotranspiration and their physical structure and chemistry. And this is bonus mitigation for climate change, and it's also complemented by the ability of forests to regulate rainfall and stabilize local climate, reducing extreme weather, so that also supports adaptation and resilience for local people, local farmers. Forests rose to the top of the climate agenda largely through their mitigation potential. And in more recent years, we've really understood the importance of forest entries for adaptation. So adaptation will be again important at COP28, and we will ensure that this sort of forestry agenda that's super high and the adaptation agenda that's super high are actually really coming together so that we understand the role of forests and trees in promoting transformational adaptation.